also we have this thing and this is the USB charging adapter and what this thing does, I'll put it back in the case so to show you kind of what the case looks like. You've probably seen this, it's Asian, um, Japanese or whatever. And this thing has a button and it's either in or out and when it's in, it's in power mode. So if you plug in the regular USB cable that comes with this in your PC, it'll charge the device, whether it's on or off. Um, I think by default, if you use a USB, um, if you just plug the USB cable in a computer, it doesn't charge. You know, It's either going to use Content Manager or nothing. Um, and you need the adapter to charge. This will allow you to use this to charge it in a PC. And then it also has data mode, where if you click it out, it goes into data mode and it's not charging. So this is um, $3.30 on Deals Extreme um, and a bunch of other sites sell it. So if that's something that you kind of would find useful if you have a laptop and you just would line up like to plug this into your laptop to charge it, it might be worth it for you. You know, I just like to buy stuff to try it out. It's all cheap, right? Um, so next let's try this. So this is a rubber coat case is what it's called and it's sold by Ami Ami um, and this was definitely my favorite of these kind of things um, it, it kinda gotta get it from Japan and it's plastic but it has a rubbery feel to it um, and it kinda encapsulates your whole thing so you kinda just put it in here and it kinda fits in right? This my, this one is actually broke because I've pulled it in and out of the s too much, and this kind of snaps in, right? Snaps tight, and then this part at the top um, snaps in. Bam! You can't get your get to your games, but you can unsnap it, right? And then this part is also supposed to snap, but I've unsnapped this so many times. Um, mostly to try out these things that I've broken this one and that's it made me sad but it also has a stand so you can stand it up and stuff like that which is awesome the good thing about this though is that it has the rubbery feel of this actually a better rubbery feel and it doesn't move so like this it's in place right none of this stuff moves it's firm um, and it feels really good. This is really, I had this thing on here for the, probably the longest. You could still see your buttons, right? It's really a good feeling product. Um, well built. You have access to all your ports. Um, and then it has the stand, right? So, really cool. I really like this. And it kind of has a tech. It kind of looks more ma masculine, you know, than some of the other cases and stuff that you'll see. It's high quality. Um, if you do plan on getting it, be really careful if you open it up because you will break it like that like I did and it won't snap close there you know or just make you know try to not open it up and close too much because eventually it will break um, and this goes for like I want to say 10 bucks on Ami Ami like 12 dollars or something like that um, and they're on, they're on back order now but they probably get them in every other week um, and I have a replacement for this one coming in, so I like it that much. But the thing about this is that you can't use some of these cases, right? Because it adds that extra girth, and it's the f it's not smooth, so it doesn't really mesh well with these cases. So, you know, if you use this, you may not be able to use this anymore. Because it's too big now, right? But if you have your protector in, you may not need to. It still does work with this, though. This, that's why this case is awesome, right? It still fits. Bam. Um, so there you have that, right? But last, lastly... Um, okay. Awesome. Um, we have... I think I had a game here. Um, this thing. Let's see if I can... Oh, psh, duh. Left it in here. Um, I want to show you this. So, 
we have this, and this is the... What is it? Uh, memory card holder. Cosmos memory card and game holder. And this is like five bucks on Amazon. It's actually like three bucks on Deals Extreme, and other sites have it. Um, and it just holds ten games. Um, you know, two, four, four here. Actually, eight games <laughs> and two memory cards. So you can kind of just slide your game in it. Bam. You know, you can see the game. And, you know, it has this little loop for something. <laughs> Maybe you loop it on that, and you open it, and you can kind of store them on each side, which is pretty cool, right? I don't know how you do this. Oh, does it go this way? Yeah, bam. So, there you go that, and then you also have the memory card part, so I've never taken my memory card out of here ever since I've bought it. 32 gigs, son. Um, let's see. La la la. Damn, it's so tiny. Yeah, so, you know, have your little memory card, and then you can throw that bitch in here. So if you have an extra one, right? Cool, doesn't slide out. Right? And then you can have that. Okay, closes. And then you have a case. So, I bought it because I figured with all these sales I'm probably going to end up buying these bum ass cards. I don't really like card games. I don't like switching out shit on the run. If I'm on the go, I don't want to have to worry about losing little tiny things. So, you know, but then again, I need to place to hold these cheapy games that I'm buying um, on sale. So, there you have it. Um, hope this video